What's going on, guys? It is your boy Angry SA Gamer, and I'm on my man T Dizzle's account. Uh, which we're gonna do a video on who is the better buff at Breakthrough 30 and Skill 13. Um, so we have Cupid. So this, th these are the two buffers, the best buffers in the game, according to me. I don't know if the Dizzle feels the same. He suggested it, so I, I think he does. But okay, who's the be best buffer between Blue Eyed Boyd and Michael? So, at skill level 13, increases friendly heroes, Cupid, increases friendly heroes, energy by 75 and damage by 76. And move speed, now he does move speed as well, by 50% for 6 seconds. Has he always done move speed? I don't know, let's have a look quickly, let's see. Because Michael was usually the one that increases move speed, um, I didn't know Cupid does that. Is this only at skill 13 that he does this? Where is Cupid though? I feel like I went past him already. He's a Valentine hero. There he is. Uh, at skill 12. Oh, at skill 11 already he does that. My bad. Oops. Okay, so we now know that I'm an idiot. And except for that, Cupid. So he does all that. Cool down 6 seconds, right? Um... Cupid's build is 9 um, Sacred Light with uh, 8 uh, and 8 uh, Revitalized Insignia. Why do I feel that I can't speak, man? Holy Conviction and then for traits we have full HP, which one? T Dizzle, stop slacking like this, man. You've got 126,000. You had 160,000 the other day. What did you do with your gems, by the way? And surely you can do a full five i'm just joking i'm just joking i'm not joking do it okay and then michael which is the coolest looking hero in the game at the moment skill level 13 deflects 75 percent damage taken for six seconds also increases attack and attack speed of eight allied heroes by 74 percent attack and attack speed for eight seconds Cool down 8 seconds. When attacked, Yero has a 50% chance of summoning an Arch Angel for 8 seconds. Arch Angel does not. Okay, so that is the only part that we need. Deflect 75% damage attack. Also increase attack and attack speed of 8 allied Yeros by 74%. Not the move speed. I could have... I. Why do I feel that if you had Minnow, you place him down... And he moves at a certain speed. And once you place down Michael, he moves faster. Like, same with Pablo. Okay, well, let's put it to the test, though. We only need these legends for their buff. We don't need them to do anything in particular. So, let me just make sure I've got to revitalize on Michael. I don't. Let's change that to revitalize. Inlay. Um, and then, just to be clear, I'm going to take off the pets. Because I only want the legends to do their thing. I don't need pets with them. Okay, and then for a minnow build, we're going to run. We're not going to do Bablo or anything or punching box. We're just going to take him like he is. At breakthrough 30, we have exactly the same minnow. There's no difference between my minnow and t Dizzle's minnow. Except maybe for the traits. Nope, mine is better. I don't think so. I have all attack though, but four... There's one four, I think. Okay. Um, let's go in. Uh, let's put Minnow in. Cupid. Um, Minnow. And Mike. And Mike. And I just want to take all the other legends out. Okay, there we have it. Our three legies. I'm gonna do dungeons because that's gonna be the easiest one to see what. <coughs> Excuse me. Let's see one attack. Which one has no troops? This one, yeah, this one doesn't have any troops. Okay, Minnow by himself. This is Minnow by himself. I'm gonna do three attacks. Okay. 
it's not gonna work at all. Attack. Okay, mana by himself. 63%. Okay, I'm just gonna run that again, just to make sure. Just so that we can get, get an average. Okay, Mano. 69. So the average is about 65% now. 66%. And the average dropped down to 62%. 62% average. Attack once again. Let's just get a good average here, boys. Okay, so we'll go 62% is the average, okay? And uh, we only, uh, okay, let's uh, run the cards finished so we can get a good average. 62% I'd say is, yeah, 62%, that's the average. That confirmed it for me, boys. Okay, an average of 62%. Let's, now we'll use one card, finish this card, and then um, go on to the other buffer. Okay, so we're gonna... Okay, Mike is auto. Is Cupid auto, though? No, Cupid... Um, Cupid's not auto proc. Okay. I have to carefully time this, then. Um, um, no, man. Let's do it this way. Attack. Let's do it this way. Place my note at a bit of a distance, yeah. Get Cupid down. Okay, there he, he is buffed. 70%. Okay, so there's our first proc at 70. Go again. Got to run it four more times. He's buffed. 70 again. Okay, well, this is a great for working out averages. The average is about 70% at the moment. Seventy-seven. Nice. Got an average of seventy-three point five. We got more seventy, so seventy-two percent probably would be the average right there. I don't know. No mathematician. Have the buff. Eighty percent. Wow. Okay. Seventy-five percent. Let's go. Seventy-five percent average. Uh, one more run. We need one more run though. Okay. 75% average. Okay, we'll keep it at a 75% average. That is from 62 to 75%. That is a good um, average, I'd say. I need to do the drop order. I can actually remove Cupid now completely. I don't need Cupid. Okay. 75. From 62 to 75. Okay. Michael is auto proc on the 79. Nice. Okay. And Cupid started off with 270 percent procs seventy eight so that's that's good that is good got an average of seventy eight point five which is much higher than the cupid average eighty two our average moved up to eighty percent average Two more uh, to do so that's on a simple just a simple base test but I, I mean this is probably the best way to test an average 82% 77 we moved down to about 79% average um, last last one attack So 79% average, much better than the 75, that's 4% better average. Let's see with 
both legends in. Let's see if we can get a double buff on Mono and what the outcome would be. <laughs> so that's that's good if you if you would like to know. Um, Michael is a better buff than Cupid. So we'll do this. So we'll do this. No, okay. Drop Mono there, Cupid and Michael. 81%. Even with both buffing him at the moment, you kidding me? I thought this might have been a hundred percent proc there. Eighty-two, eighty-two percent. That's a good average. It's a good average. But uh, with averages like that, I would say that I'd rather go with Michael than running both. 83 I mean that's pretty consistent right there I'm gonna run five times just to make it even for all of them okay, he's got both. 83 that I mean that is consistency man 82 82 83 83 so the last one if we can get a 83 the average is pretty good last one it's got an average of 82.2 at the moment 82.5 percent at the moment Eighty one. Eighty two percent is a pretty good average there you have it if you wanted to know which legend is the better buff between michael and cupid it is michael running both would just mean that you've got less of um, a head-on team then you'll mostly have a buff team if you, if you know what I'm saying if you, if you get what I'm trying to get at that is it for the video boys and girls I hope you enjoyed it please consider hitting the subscribe button and I'll see you guys in the next video goodbye